Hi, it's Anna from Inkspilla. So a super common thing that happens, I mean, obviously not just with agencies, but I think agencies um, can easily fall victim to this, is that you end up with an absolute Frankenstein monster of website messaging, LinkedIn saying one thing, one page on the website, leading with one sort of message or tone and then another one being completely different. And, you know, it's just normal, I think, as you're sort of, growing and scaling rapidly and things are busy and maybe you've got a launch event maybe you're gonna decide to like bolt on a new service and you know you want to sort of be all things to all people so bits and bobs get added on here but yeah then you get this like amorphous mess and no one knows what the message is meant to be how you're meant to speak and actually, like, that's probably fine for like a little while. <laughs> but when you want to get when you're repositioning or you want to be really intentional around sort of outreach and marketing and um, you just need to like really strip it back and get down to the core of who you're speaking to and like how you want to be talking to that person. And that's where obviously messaging comes into play and messaging playbooks. And they're really important because they put up those guardrails. So you'll always know whether something's on message or not, in the right tone or not. Um, and then anyone that writes for you, people aren't gonna go off piste. There's always, I mean, obviously someone's got to enforce that, <laughs> but it, you know, it just becomes easier to keep it in check and and have a and have also like things like scorecards, um, guidelines, checklists that make sure it stays in check and not, nothing gets published. And if it's not, you know, on voice, on message, if it's not tying back to your positioning, and if there's not really any sort of obvious benefit to your ideal client reading it, you just don't publish it. And that's what messaging guidelines do so if that is something you are struggling with if you if you have a frankenstein monster of a website um, then that's exactly what we help what we what i help with we can work on um so yeah give me a call and we can have a chat and see if it's a fit